Hi everybody, my name is Winnie. Today I will be showing you how to make this lemon strawberry shortcake with Philadelphia cream cheese. Alright, so first off we have the shortcake to make. I have in here a cup of flour, a quarter cup of sugar, a quarter teaspoon of salt, one teaspoon of baking powder, and the zest of one lemon. And then to that I added the most important ingredient, Philadelphia cream cheese, four ounces cubed, as well as a tablespoon of butter. So growing up in Taiwan, cream cheese wasn't something that was very common. So now that I live in the States, I love to add it to any recipe that I can, especially desserts. It makes such a big difference, giving any dessert that you add it to that really rich, creamy texture. You end up having a really smooth, rich shortcake as opposed to a dry, crumbly shortcake. So I have my mixture here resembling sand, a coarse sand, a coarse crumble. So now I'm going to clean off my tool here. To this I'm adding a third of a cup of milk. I like to make a well in the middle of the dry ingredients and then just add the milk to it and then mix and slowly add all of that dry ingredient into the wet. You keep mixing until it comes together to form a ball so that you have the dough of your shortcake. Alright, so it's coming together. You want to make sure you get all of the dry ingredients at the bottom of the bowl. Make sure everything gets wet. And then I'm just putting down the silicone mat. I really like working on this because it makes cleanup really simple afterwards. I'm getting some flour here. You want to dust your work surface with some flour. And then turn out the bowl. Scrape all of that dough out onto your work surface. Okay, so the mixture is a little bit soft, a little bit wet. Just add some flour to it so it doesn't stick. You want to knead it just a few times until all of the ingredients are combined. So this is my favorite part of making the shortcake. I really like to work with my hands, I like to get a little dirty, but this is a great part to involve your kids in. You can get them to help you knead a little bit, give everyone a ball of dough, everyone gets involved. So I've quartered my dough now. I've made four small balls. You want them fairly round, and then you just flatten them a little bit. Now these are ready to go into the oven, 350 degrees, 15 minutes, or until the tops are golden brown. And while these bake, I'm going to get together the strawberries. Four cups of strawberries, two thirds cup of sugar, and the zest and juice of two lemons. You can add more lemon juice, less lemon juice, more sugar, less sugar. It's up to you, it's all to taste. I like my strawberries sour and tart. So, pop these in the oven. I'll see you back here in a bit. All right, so we're close to the end. We're ready for assembly now. I have my shortcake that has baked and cooled. I've cut it in half. I have my strawberries that I've tossed in lemon juice and sugar. And then I have some fresh cream that I whipped up. So, let's get this together. Just pile on the strawberries. Don't worry about that juice. The juice that drips onto the plate it's all just going to be soaked up by the shortcake later on. Just adds to the yummy goodness. It's all good. And then now a dollop of whipped cream. And it's ready for its top. I like to put the top a little bit offset so that you can see all of that goodness on the inside. And then to decorate, I'm just going to slice strawberries, just a couple of slices thin, 
And then with these, I'm just putting them on top to make it a little pretty. I also have here a slice of lemon. I'm just cutting a slit into it. And then if you twist it, and if you can get that, oh, my strawberries are falling off. See, that's the trick, getting them to stay. So, stay. And then the lemon. Or not. I'll just set it this way. Now for the best part, the tasting. Make sure to get a little bit of everything in there. Mm. This is one of my favorite desserts. You guys get baking? I'm finishing this on the porch. <laughs>